My H4 Nightbreaker from Osram has finally arrived. This is the LED version which is approved by the European governments in 98% of the countries. There is a link for it down below so you can check your country if it's approved or not. Today we're going to test them on my car and uh, also on the bench to see how it works. It's very easy to change, change the bulbs. You just unleash these two hooks, open this lamp and remove the old H4 bulbs. Then you take the fantastic Osram one. You can loosen this one because on some cars it is more beneficial to install this one first. Then you just need to put the bulb inside and find the, the, the grooves yep. and snap it in place. And there you have it. Job's done. Next time, open it. Very fast and easy. You need to do one small modification to install this one because this dust boot is made for the halogen. With the pins, we need to make a hole to make this one fit. You can cut it by a small side cutter. Use it like a scissor. It seems to do the trick. Yeah, maybe. This one needs to fit on the outside here. It worked! <laughs> Let's uh, compare the two bulbs, uh, how they are performing when it comes to wattage and heat, at least amperage drawing. So and let's connect them to my uh, voltmeter and let's see how that goes. I found this uh, online how to connect them. Okay, let's start by the halogen bulb and let's put them over here and see how that performs. Here we are on. You can see here 65 watts, 4.7 amps. And yeah, very bright. Very bright indeed. So let's switch to this one. Okay, also an LED bulb and the same power. Twenty six watt, close to two amps. Again, very bright, very bright. So this is uh, half the power, and I don't know how much light, but probably more. You can hear the fan. Osram has also approved this very nice, uh, which for the Vanagon is a parking light, W5W, and they look like this, very tiny and nice. Yeah, seems to be containing one LED chip. Let's uh, go ahead and install the lights on the car and maybe we can do some measurements to see how they compare um, uh, looks-wise. Back in the car. And this plug is a standard uh, which fits straight on this one. Okay, here you can clearly see the difference. LED and the halogen. <laughs> Definitely a big difference. But you can also see on this uh, cutoff, it is perfect like on the halogen. Okay, hopefully you can hear me. I have no uh, lux, lux meter. Um, let's 
see where is the best point. Hopefully you can see this. It is 3,500 rocks. This one, only 0.9.5 kilowatts. 950 rocks. Again, 3100 lux, 900 lux. It's possible to put this one over here, maybe. Does it work? Yep. LED. All again. Amazing, eh? Another very nice thing when it comes to LED, it comes on instantly. Just watch this. Look at the delay on the halogen one. Instant. The parking light on my car is in the side light. So here we have this uh, standard bulb holders. These bulbs have no polarity, so you can put it in whatever direction you like, it will still work. Amazingly bright. And then we just put it inside this hole here, and then we have a parking light in the side light. Job well done.